have him part of the meetings with television, wanted him to learn all the nuances of being a head coach. Thomas Jefferson, Shimmy's baseline. And pass it to Wake Gasol, what a plus for a coach. Lynn, he loves pulling up like that. 18, Douglas will fire, way off the mark. Lynn, down court to kill Patrick, leaking out for two. You have to love that pass. Lynn kept his head up the entire time. One or two dribbles as they busted out. Keep your head up, look ahead, off the dribble, touchdown! And he's only had one more field goal attempt since then. Spent a lot of time on the bench. Lynn with a much needed three there for Brooklyn. Hopefully that gets him going in the second half. Working Lopez to the hook, halfway down, popped out. Here comes Lynn in transition. One on three and draws the whistle anyway. Took a hard slap against the wrist. Frail to you. He just looks frail to me right now. And he, he's moving so gingerly, Mike. Levert with an answer. He too has found his stroke. Got over it. Parsons couldn't get it to go. Lynn racing ahead. Leads Levert. Push from behind. No whistle. And now a foul comes in. Screen. Lynn will pull up from 16 and cash it in. Well, the reason he was open because Brooke Lopez set a solid screen and Lynn ran the defender into the screen. Jeremy Lynn, screen is solid. Lynn gets an open look, knocks down that mid range. Hollis Jefferson gives it up. Levert gives it back. Hollis Jefferson puts it down. Well, it's just. Trying to shake free, he does, and misses the layup. The tip, no, and Lynn finally corrals it for Brooklyn. Very fortunate for Brooklyn. Kilpatrick, shimmying inside, can't bank it home, but a whistle. Douglas, blocked. Great help by Booker, and saved for Brooklyn. After the block, the great save. Lynn out of control, but somehow spun it up and off. Kilpatrick will back it out now. Didn't have the look he wanted. Brooklyn's done a lot of small things out there tonight that don't go unnoticed by the staff, giving them another opportunity to score here. Lynn just got clobbered, grabs his wrist, no whistle on the other end. Conley can't finish. Nets trying to scramble back on D as Conley misses the three, and Booker does a nice job to box out Randall. He sure did. He fought Zeebel that time for that offensive rebound. And Lee's still in some pain after getting whacked that last time down the floor, and this time he finally will get the whistle. Trevor Booker winning plays, Mike. Well, you come over, you rotate, you save a layup attempt, and you save the basketball. Big play by Booker. With us? Now, here is the moment where Jeremy Lynn got banged and dinged his wrist. There was no foul call there. And then the next time down the floor, Lynn was hit from behind, and now he is at the line, but still grabbing at his left wrist. Well, you know, after the turnover there, non-call on Lynn, Brooklyn did a great job of getting back and saving the layup attempt. They battled him, battled him, came back up with the basketball. Lynn hits the free throw. Lynn hits them both. It's a five-point Brooklyn lead. Levert behind him. Conley can't hit. And the rebound, loose. And a foul called against who? If it's Lynn, it's number six. And it's on, it's on Zach Randolph? It's on Zach Randolph. Initially, it looked like the official signaled it was staying here. Instead, it's Randolph. Memphis is over the limit. And that'll send Brooklyn to the line. Take advantage of the bonus free throws right now in the game. 30 attempts for Brooklyn, 34. And watch on the inside, there's Zebo right there who crashes into Lynn, and maybe the complaining time after time paid off for Jeremy Lynn. Lynn, three of four from the line in this game. Hits. Steady hand. Lynn sinks four straight free throws to give the Nets a seven point lead. On Kilpatrick. Lynn now switched on Green. Lynn trying to take it to him. Fading away, puts it home! Lynn switched on Green again. Backing it up, seven to shoot. Lynn will fire, you bet! Jeremy Lynn with 11 in the corner is trying to close a victory for Brooklyn. And his teammates clearly happy to have him back.
Well, you just talked about the value of having him on the floor. Kenny Atkinson mentioning it to you. And we'll take a look. Watch this difficult pull back, spin away, sizes up the big man on him, takes it at him, and now show and fade, but squared up completely. And then bring his bench up on the floor. The big three by Jeremy Lin. Lin and Hollis Jefferson along with that Nets bench celebrate as Brooklyn steals one in Memphis. 122-109 the final. An impressive road victory for Kenny Atkinson's squad.